Hey, hey, welcome to You Can Play It Too, a series where I break down fingerstyle guitar sounds so much that pretty much anyone can just pick up a guitar and play along. Today we'll be working on Van of the Starry Night by Kotaro Oshio, and this is part zero. We will be covering the techniques used in this song. Now, if you are familiar with these techniques already, you can feel free to skip part zero and just go straight to part one. The main topics we'll be covering in this video are percussives, harmonics, thumb fretting, and partial bars. All right, let's jump right in. All right, let's start off with percussives. Percussives are used throughout this entire piece, and it is the backbone of this piece. And the way we play it is by planting our fingers a little bit harder than usual, like this. What we want to do is look at the notes we are playing right after the percussive. For example, this bar. In this bar, we will be playing two strings right after the percussive. So we will be planting our fingers on the two strings we will be playing a little bit harder than usual and then playing it right after, like this. If we see a single note right after, for example, this bar, we will be planting it on the single string that we will pluck right after, like this. Let's hear that in context. Now let's hear the second half of that bar. As you can see, we have two single string percussives. These might be a little bit tricky at first. Even if you miss the string, it is fine. Just move on. Now let's hear a little bit more. All right, let's move on to harmonics. We will be playing two harmonics in this entire piece. All the harmonics you will be hearing are these two same harmonics being repeated. And here is the bar. And let's hear it first. Now the way we play a harmonic is by placing our fretting hand on the fret shown on the score gently, without pressing down the string at all. All I'm doing is placing my finger on the string. And then you want to pluck the string, then let go of your fretting hand. Now if you can time that a little bit better, you can get the harmonics to last a little bit longer. All right, let's move on to thumb fretting. Thumb fretting is optional for some parts, but I would say it's almost necessary in some other parts as well. Now, for example, this bar. I prefer using my thumb to play this bar. This part, I'm using my thumb to fret the 6th string 2nd fret and then the 5th string 2nd fret as well, which is a lot harder than usual. But if you cannot reach it with your thumb, you can also use a different fingering like this.
This is the optional part. But for some of these other parts, using your thumb will make it a lot easier. For example, this part. So it is a lot easier if you can learn how to use your thumb to fret strings. And now let's take a look at partial bars. Partial bars are often used in conjunction with thumb fretting. For example, this part. So right here, I'm doing a partial bar with my index finger. I'm fretting strings two, three, and four. And then I'm fretting string six with my thumb. And finally, let's take a look at a different partial bar. Right here, I am doing a partial bar on four strings, string one, two, three, and four. And here are a couple of things that might help you with a partial bar. Uh, first of all, you can try to pull back on your neck a little bit. So what you want to do is pull back with your right arm and pull back with your left arm and push forward with your body. This way, I can fret the strings without even using my thumb. And the second tip is by adding in your thumb as well. So if you pull and pinch at the same time, it'll make it a lot easier to do a partial bar, or any bar in general. That's pretty much it. And that was part zero of Pavan of the Starry Night by Kotaro Oshio. If you have any questions, feel free to leave it down in the comments below and I will answer it if I can. Feel free to also watch my complete cover of this song or you can start learning the actual song from part one. Alright, hope you have a nice day and see you in the next video.